PhotoP is a web-based photo and graphics editor. It's free to use and is supported by ads. In this video, we'll take a closer look at the Marquee Selection tool. It's located in the Move and Selection area of the toolbar. The tool is represented by an icon. There's an arrow in the bottom right corner. This indicates that there are more tools behind the icon. When you long press on the icon, you'll see a rectangle select and a ellipse select option. With the Rectangle Select tool, you can make rectangular selections anywhere, just by dragging. You can move the selection by pressing on it, and deselect it by clicking anywhere on the canvas. You can also make a perfect square by holding the Shift button as you're making the selection. A similar alternative is available when using the Ellipse tool. When holding the Shift key, Photo P will draw a perfect circle instead of an ellipse. To cut a selection, first select the layer the item is in. Then select the item you want to cut. To cut it out, go to the pull-down menu under Edit in the top menu. Scroll down and select Cut. Photo P cuts the selection. You can paste it by going back to the pull-down menu and choosing Paste. The image is back, but this time it has its own layer, so it's free of its original location. That means you can move it independently within your project. To add to a selection, click on the Unite button in the top menu. Now all the selections you make are joined together, making one united selection. You can do the opposite by pressing on the Subtract button next to it. Now when you make a selection, its area is removed from the previous selection. And last in the menu is the Intersect button. This option will make a selection at the intersection of any two selections. Feathering gives you the option to soften the edges of a selection. If you set the feather level at zero before making a selection, the cut will give a hard edge. But if you set the feather level at a positive value before making the selection, then the cut will give a soft edge. Freestyle is the most common choice for making selections. It lets you select freely without any constraints, but it does require some accuracy. An alternative is Fixed Ratio. Fixed Ratio uses the values in the input boxes to make a selection. If you want, you can enter the width and height values, and Photo P will restrict your selection to that ratio. If you know the actual values you need, you can use the Fixed Size option. Photo P will get the size from the values entered into the boxes and make your selection accordingly. The selection options for the Ellipse Select tool are very similar to the Rectangle Select tool. If you understand one, you'll understand both. And that's the Marquee tool in Photo P. If you'd like to see more content like this, simply subscribe to my channel or watch one of my other videos. Thank you.